Hello everybody, I'm back with Resident Evil 2. <clears throat> I did uh, only do one video and then kind of end the whole session because, you know, life came up. Um, just my wife. We kind of went and just kind of played Hearthstone for a little bit, so... I got a nice little water bottle beside me, so I could <clears throat> drink and get that water, that agua, that life juice in me. And now we're back in the RPD building, and uh, was I okay? I wasn't exactly 100% clear where to go. Just gonna run right in here. Grab them bullets. Combine them bullets. Nope, did not pause the game. Ooh, first herb. First aid. First herb. You know what? I can probably stand to put one of those first herbs. Uh, first aid sprays away. I'll put both of them away and just kind of keep my herb on me. I don't expect to really get too beat up, but you never know. I was always a big fan of the old Resident Evil games. They terrified the hell out of me when I was younger, and then as I got older, I saw how funny they were. Oh. <laughs> you guys are going to like this part. Anyone who doesn't like gore, look away now. It doesn't look as good as it could get. Because my graphics quality is down. I think we're just going to avoid that. That's locked. Also, I wasn't listening to that radio broadcast, so I oh, thought I heard something about Brad Vickers. No. You know, I don't know what I heard. I really don't. Oh, she's gonna break through. I'm just gonna dip in here. <clears throat> Record of events. Let me get my reading voice open. September 25th. We're turning the station into a temporary shelter due to the massive sudden outbreak. All police personnel have been inducted to make the safety of the citizens their top priority as to as we try to accommodate as many of them as possible. <coughs> At, uh, September 25th. Addendum. One of the refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, resulting in the death of one officer and injuring three others. The person we believe in question was quickly retained. We believe this was simply a case of someone snapping under intense stress. A mob attacked the station today, resulting in a number of casualties. A few survivors were able to make it to safety, or were able to make it safely behind the emergency shutters, but surrounded us. But surrounded as we are, it'll be hard for us to, for any of us to escape this place. We're not sure we can fix any of our comm equipment, so we remain cut off from the outside world. September twenty seventh. <sighs> Sorry, tired. I go to work in five hours. There was another clash at the west side of the station around 1 p.m. Twelve people died, and there was only a handful of survivors left. Everything is falling into disarray here. David Ford. Well, things certainly sound like they didn't go according to plan. Things don't look like they went according to plan. I think I spotted some bullets over here before I get too far. Oopsie daisy. I don't think that's safe. Ooh. 
All right. I think I can probably get around Tubby over here. As long as we don't bother him. Ah, oh, shit. We bothered him. Okay. <clears throat> can reload. And make sure he's dead. We good, fam. That's locked. We're not that good. Okay. I'm gonna step right over here. This is a gun battery. Two gun battery, handgun ammo, shotgun shells, mag ammo. There's a lot of ammo left around. Blah blah blah. All right, got it. What is this ammo? Or powder? I don't think I can get into that safe just yet because I didn't pick up any sort of combo. Hang on, always, uh, always take that. What do we got here? More reading. <coughs> Operation report. September twenty eighth, two thirty a.m. It's down to just me and three others. No weapons, no ammo, and too many skirmishes. I have drained us mentally and physically. We're not going to make it. Officer Phillips once suggested we escape through the sewers. Apparently there's a secret tunnel underneath this place. Left over from its museum days. I brushed her uh, idea off, but now it's not so sounding all that bad. Sorry. <coughs> Sometimes I feel like I'm dyslexic. <laughs> yeah. There's no proof that even a tunnel or that the sewers aren't infested with zombies. But I don't want to sit here and wait to die either. It's a long shot, but I'm going to try to find out what I can about that tunnel. Elliot Howard. Edward. Rookie's first assignment. Leon S. Kennedy. We're putting you on a very special case for your first assignment. Your mission is to unlock your desk. The key to your success is in the initials of our first names. Input the letters in order of our desk. There are two locks, one on each side of your desk. Make sure you can get them both. Basically... Your first task is to remember your fellow officers' names, but you figured that much out, right? Good luck, Leon. By the way, it might make, might take a little work to get Scott to give you a straight answer. Scrawled on the corner, drops of blood. Be glad you're not here, rookie. So we got David Ford. We got Elliot Edward. And Neil Carlton or Carl Scene or whatever. Okay, my bad. We got Neil, Elliot, and David. So Ned. First break in. I just know he's gonna wake up. We have Marvin, Rita, there we go, just so I don't have to bother him, he likes to sleep, high capacity mag. I'm getting all sorts of achievements. I don't think there's anything on his desk that I need. So I think I'm just gonna leave him there to sleep. Wait. Can we come in here? Okay, I don't have the key for it. I'm not complaining. We're gonna go ahead and run around. Oh my god, Jesus. Shit. Sorry, I'm trying to be sparing here. Scared the shit out of me. Oh 
Stay down. Come on. Good? Good? Okay. Don't worry, guys. He's just sleeping. He's tired. Rough day at work. Uh, fucking course. Son of a bitch. What is wrong with Leon's hair? Slash and dash, and he's gone. Oh, what is he awake to? I killed you. Son of a bitch. Let's see if I can't slash. <laughs> I think he's dead now. Alright, well, now you can't break in. Kind of a choke point, so I figured I would go ahead and uh, it seemed like a choke point, so I figured I'd go ahead and set that there, so they couldn't break in if I ca or in case I needed to run all the way up there. You feel me? Go ahead and do that. That was just my phone. Uh, it's just tell me about herbs. Probably stand to put some of my gunpowder away for right now. Uh, I'll put an herb away too. Just for right now. If I need to come back, I can. Go ahead and combine those. Make a red and green herb, which are strong combo. And I don't have any film, so I don't need to be here right now. Uh, what does this do? I just turns these lights on. All right, perfect. All right, now that I'm at a saving spot, I think I'm gonna go ahead and call that an episode. Um, thank you for sticking around, guys. If you watched the episode, um, hope you enjoyed it. I'm sorry, I'm still kind of learning to get used to the whole talking to myself thing without stuttering, without <clears throat> um, having to clear my throat all the time. Um, but thank you for sticking around. If you liked what you saw. Subscribe. I need to get to bed soon because I do get up. I have to get up in five hours to work my third shift job. Not really looking forward to that. Um, that's it. Like I said, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys uh, in the next video. Thank you.